The President convened a meeting of all the premiers of the country two days ago, and I was very clear in that meeting to tell President Ramaphosa, if we can't fix electricity, it's the end of all of us as leadership and as society. We have to fix this problem, not tomorrow, not next week, not next month, not next year. We need to fix it now because it's in Tosia Mosheega. And I want to commit to you, and I remain hopeful, that when the president address the nation in the next few hours or so, that all the issues related to the long-term solution of electricity will be addressed in that, uh, in that meeting. But where we stand as the Gauteng Provincial Government, even though we don't have a mandate to run the issue of electricity, that the issue of electricity, the mandate lies with national government and the mandate lies with local government, as the provincial government led by you will not fold our arms and say there's nothing we can do on the issue of electricity. We will be with you, we will be with communities, we will be in structures so that we can resolve the problem. So after meeting with your leadership in this particular school, on Friday, I led a delegation of mayors, I led a delegation of MMCs, I led a delegation of community leaders to meet with ESCOM so that we can deal with the issue, especially the issue of Laezola. And that part was captured by Ukansela Wenu, and I want to reiterate that resolution. That no ESCOM employer or ESCOM as an institution will come to this community to disconnect this community until we have agreed on a program of action together with the community. So everything will remain the way it is. Secondly, that we know there are challenges of some substation and mini stations. ESCOM is coming here on Tuesday to take analysis of those damaged mini stations and substation and caused that damage and convene a meeting together with the community leaders to then declare how long will it take for them to fix those mini stations and other related problems.